Oh man, front tire completely off. Is a big hill. <laughs> Woo, holy damn! Look at that in the background, man. Man, you want steep? This is this is steep. Oh my god! This is my first run up at the Fujimi Fujimi Panorama uh, Mountain Bike Resort. Well, not Mountain Bike Resort. Sorry, it's a resort for normally um, uh, snow and stuff in the uh, winter, of course. But um, obviously, we're here in summer, and oh, this is going to be pretty scary riding down this. This is so high. This I think it's about 900 to 1,000 meters tall vertical wise. And um, we're on the Rocky Mountain Slayer Park Edition with the big boys on the front there. The big coil shock here. And it's a 27.5 bike with uh, no dropper post, obviously. You don't need it. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't need it. But um, oh my God, this is this is insane. I think I've already, I've already surpassed the mountain at home height wise. <laughs> You know, it's just another day, day, Daisy Hill though, of course. <laughs> I'm gonna try and start on the easy line first, and then we'll um, make our way up. But this is gonna be, this is gonna be worried now about the black line of how serious they might actually be. <laughs> so yeah, I haven't seen any footage of this place really. I watched uh, BCPOV's video from five years ago, and um, also BKXC video. His video was also about five years ago, so I haven't seen much newer content from like your big name creators or anything like that so this should be uh an experience to say the least this um package here with the bike um the helmet the uh, bell no it's not i don't know what kind of helmet that is but um with the helmet the bike and uh, you also do get some gear as well like uh knee pads elbow pads and gloves but i already bought me on gloves of course fist represent <laughs> um so um, you do get all that type of stuff and, it only, and also the gondola pass as well and this is for all day you get up until from 9am to 4pm and uh, oh my god the trails just look oh, they look very steep I hope that's the, I hope that's the black one because <laughs> oh my um, yeah it only costs me it was about 200 bucks Australian dollars so it's like 190 or 1900 yen or something like that 19,000 yen sorry which is yeah about 190 200 dollars in australian dollars i don't know what that is in us it'd probably be a lot cheaper in us but um yeah not bad i don't think i think you pay more than that you know you pay more than that at boomers and whatnot but yeah wow here we go let's i'll see you at the top we still got a long way to go <laughs> a lot of elevation too Find where we need to go here. First time the skill up there, you know, to just one, jump into two. These bars are very a lot more tight as well, so all right, number one. <laughs> sure I'll figure out what the trail names are soon. But I've got a full face on so I don't know if you'll be able to hear me as well as normal. Oh this bike is uh different <laughs> but uh wow the forestry here is just incredible <laughs> this bike though <laughs> oh my gosh oh. damn it's quite quick Oh my, <laughs> for a green one it's quite rough. Summer they have this mountain bike park and it's a gondola access which is just insane that gondola ride. Felt like it wasn't gonna end. <laughs> it just kept going up and up and up. And oh, I reckon I'm gonna have some serious arm pump. Which is something I never get when I normally ride, especially some people get arm pumped like boomers and stuff. I don't, I get hand like hand, it gets a bit sore, but 
other than that, nothing too wild with the arms. Oh yeah. Yep. <laughs> Alright, uh, green to the left, here we go, we drop. Just gotta get used to it, <laughs> we'll drop there. Yep, we're rolling, alright, blue hornet, let's um, see what we're about here. I'm pretty sure this is an open, flowy trail. None of these trails have names on trail forks either. I think a couple of them do, but yeah, this one's blue hornet. Nice jump there. Table. Big one's gone. Oh yeah, quite a few jumps here. Woo! Little ones. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the flowy jump trail. Try and keep my speed going. Yeah. <laughs> On this uh, big downhill rig. Just like step down. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> Oh, little ones. Woo, they're very picky. <laughs> to keep myself back on the bike. Try not to get booted. Oh, yeah. And it just kind of cleared that one. Woo. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah, this bike is quite fun. Big tabletop here. But it definitely went to flight pretty easily. <laughs> Pump that and have more than enough speed for that jump. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, this is way more smooth as well. Quite moist the ground. Look like a little shark fin looking thing. Step down. The tabletop. That was cool. Pretty cool section. I think it continues on here. This is number nine. It's a blue trail, so. Keep track. Ooh. Oh yeah, some more jumps. Yo, <laughs> just little ones, but they're pretty cool. Yeah, I guess you could probably hip out of that if you're banging it. <laughs> we got down here pretty fast. Breaking bumps. <laughs> Alright, into the darkness. Ooh, some real breaker bumps through there. Ooh. Yeah, the blue hornet is pretty cool. A little tabletop. Yeah, this car's fun. <laughs> I'm still right on the edge of this cliff too. <laughs> Oh wow. The um <laughs> Oh man front tire completely washed. Must be a bit Okay well now we're dirty, at least I bought some spare clothes. Damn that just it just gripped in. Straight into the slippery mud, alright I gotta be careful of that then. <laughs> oh it's all good. Yeah. Now right, let's make sure bike's all sweet. It's looking good. Oh, I can't believe how much that gripped in. Like literally, it's just it just went soft. No, I guess I was getting a bit rowdy. <laughs> My bloody fresh pants are all covered in mud. Let's see the damage on the phone. Oh, it blew the zip off. Oh, yeah, that's some, uh, some new crackage on the um, external screen. <laughs> but it's all right. It's um, only the uh, protector, so the zip still works. That's good. Okay, I guess we'll continue on this blue run. Oh, man, that, that sucked, eh? The whole tire just completely slid out in the mud. That I wasn't ready for. <laughs> now my feet are all slippery and stuff. Oh, oh I missed the step up. <laughs> all right, we'll take it a bit easier. <laughs> Not too easy though. Yeah, very slippery on the front. Um, it could be just be a downhill thing. I'm used to riding my normal bike. 
but um, yeah, <laughs> very slippery through here. So I gotta be careful in these corners. Can't believe how easy that slid. Yeah, the back brakes still work, front brakes work, so. Oh, hit by an acorn or something. <laughs> oh, man, can't be crashed on the first run. <laughs> Although the first run is like seven or eight k's. <laughs> Here's what it is. Just be careful around these corners down here. It's very slippery. Oh well, shit happens. <laughs> That's some hectic brake bumps. Come to think of it, I have thought my uh, rear was sliding a lot. The tyres could be just too hard as well. Oh well, what the heck? <laughs> oh, I just gotta be careful in these big corners. Jump coming up here, so. I didn't actually want the downhill bike, I wanted the uh, little mountain, but. They gave me the DH and I was like, oh, well, you know, we'll just do it. <laughs> oh my God, you can't be serious. How slippery is it? <laughs> How slippery is this? <laughs> oh man, this is so slippery. I was straight on the bars that time. That was just a little boring crash, that one. Looks better. Oh man, I can't believe it. My front is just washing so easily as well. I don't think taking oh, them tires are so hard. No, let's take a bit of air out there. I don't know if that'll help. Man, I can't believe that. That was, that was the most chill crash ever, but. <laughs> Man, yeah, as you as you know, if you watch the channel, crashing is not a um, common thing. But man, <laughs> the slipperiness of this dirt is just yeah. Now it's just gonna be hard. Yeah. <laughs> now I gotta make it even more easy. I've already crashed twice. <laughs> Jump stand wasn't me at all. It's all good. These are all pretty chilled. Oh, I can't believe that. Am I at the bottom? I think I'm pretty much at the bottom. All right. <laughs> oh, well, I guess maybe not, actually. But, um, yeah, anyway. Yeah, it looks like we... Ah, at the bottom. Okay, there we go. That's full one. <laughs> one run down, two crashes. And um, looks like we can just push straight up there, so. All right, um, okay, anyways, uh, good start, I guess. I'm gonna hit up some more tech trials now. Okay, so this is pretty much what it looks like when you're walking in. And, um, yeah, you just gotta put your bike straight in. Again, down this little green one, and um, then we'll jump onto the blue, which isn't too far in. Number six, so number six goes all the way down, and then there's an option of a black or continue blue the whole way, pretty much. So I might, might just do that. Yeah, no more crashes, hopefully. <laughs> you know, it happens. See, it happens. I'm gonna take this pretty comfortable. <laughs> 
come a little way up the top. Okay, this is way more, way more gnarly than the green already. <laughs> Drop there, yeah, I'll definitely take a slow. <laughs> I don't feel overly bad on the bike either. It's just a bit awkward and of course I've never ridden one before. We're here on the blue trail, which does go all the way to the bottom. This will probably be a much longer, slower run, obviously. Very chunky these roots. So yeah, we get there and it's very wet through here so <laughs> which makes which of these these roots are going slippery, which they are. Ooh. They definitely are. <laughs> oh. Oh. You really gotta pick your lines. Speed through this. Yes, I am just so worried about slipping out now. <laughs> oh, that was gnarly. Probably won. So I will at least try one of them. They say a stream on them, so that's going to be scared too. <laughs> Ooh, we have to be so tight. This is your first time on the channel. Trust me, I'm not actually a bad rider. <laughs> at least I don't think I am. Most of the time. So yeah, I'm definitely out of my elements with this bike. And Riding these trails, I think it's always on my bike or even my new bike. I think it's so much more comfortable. It's very dark in here. GoPro's gonna struggle for a bit. Up there. Ooh. I don't know if I should have wore clips. I reckon those crashes would have come out way worse. <laughs> Damn, it's so gnarly and tight from here. You can really see how slippery it is back there on that wet part. Uh, that looks like the A line. The B line here. Yeah, it looks like it just it just rubs out, and they just leave it, which is cool. Drop. Pick up speed so fast. <laughs> oh, off the line. Up. <laughs> There's so many lines through here. Another one of these like drop looking things. I'll try and squeeze off to the right. <laughs> Seat's a bit high. Oh, all right. Oh, yep. I've seen this on videos. Coming through here. All right, we got a black trail here. All righty, I guess this is the time we do the black. All righty, let's do it. <laughs> let's do it, I guess. Into the black trail. Number 12. Here at uh, the Jimmy Mountain Bike Park. I'm definitely gonna take you cautious and have a look at the features first. Oh, oh not go too slow, but trail speed. <laughs> a little bit slower than trail speed. Go <laughs> <laughs> <That> the easy way. <laughs> little bridge just over here. Oh, yeah. oh this, this rotted out stuff is kind of cool. Looks really cool actually. Once you get to the green trail that way, I might just stick on the black and see how we go. That might have been just the easy part though. Look at this. <laughs> oh, there's so many lines. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> so many different lines to choose from. Ooh. Okay. Very steep shoot here. Find it. Not that steep. Yeah, the black is... Uh, Definitely. Oh, Was that or something up in the bush there? It looked like a bear. <laughs> Probably wasn't. <laughs> okay. 
Here's this guy here on the black. Second run down, by the way, so. <laughs> Wow, the bike is very, very nimble on the front end. I look at that. I am just running the back, back brakes more than anything because I'm not really a front brakes guy most of the time. I can see why people like these downhill bikes. <laughs> just eats everything in you. Pretty fun ride to be honest. This is trail number 12 at Fujimi Panorama. My hands are starting to get sore again. <laughs> a bit of a fast bit. Keep the rocks just here. <laughs> oh boy. Almost lost her again. <laughs> the front end just, it goes so easily. You lose the front end so fast. Okay, I might as well stick to it, eh? Stick it out on the bike on 13 now. This is <laughs> this is a bit wild. <laughs> like we're gonna get steep here. In a minute. Try and keep a slow winning control. I okay, see so yeah, number 12 wasn't too bad, but. Number 13, guys. Unlucky 13, eh? It's my dad's birthday. Number 13. Ooh. Yeah. Definitely chunky through this. A drop to the right somewhere. Maybe not. Oh, yeah, I see. It's alright, we can know. That's pretty big. It's pretty big, but not. Terrible. Definitely would have been doable. That was sort of the A line. <laughs> Man, <laughs> they must change brake rotors here every every ride. <laughs> it's not making any sound. Or if it is, it's very minimal. Ooh. Alrighty, what have we got up here? Blue Trail, and there's two more to my right over there as well. This one's called the Twister, I'm pretty sure it's a Blue Trail. Just to have a blue sign. <laughs> oh, the leaves, look at them all. Slightly keeping those uh, roots underneath. Those roots are slippery. <laughs> right down the guts we go. Oh, that's slippery there. Wow. Oh, yeah. Very. I'm going to be very cautious through this. Because it's slightly wet and. What the hell? <laughs> it's a bit too tall for that, I think. <laughs> Even though I'm not tall at all. Oh, there's a whole heap of different trails through here. Yeah, we're going to be taking it super easy in these corners. Okay, we're racing in the workout. <laughs> Yeah, on the videos, um, it didn't look like overly steep. It looked very, uh, very tame, but obviously when you're here, it's way more steep than you think, especially on camera. Oh, that's very slippery around that. I'm not gonna try and rail that. <laughs> um, yeah, there's a little wooden feature coming up. Oh, this is, oh my God. I wouldn't want to be racing this. You gotta be mad. I know there's, oh my. There's a race here, like either soon, I think it's next week. No, a little wooden feature, the first one I've seen. Oh my! <laughs> the end of it had like a full drop going on. Damn, I just went straight into that. The boxes just ate it. <laughs> when I say the boxes, I mean the forks. What did you do? There. This is run number two, and we've taken the blue and black run down on one of them. There is another couple black trails still. 
one of them says a stream on it, so I don't know if I want to test myself with that today. But the black trails that I did ride, uh, 12 and 13, they were fine. They were all good. Once you figure out the lines a bit better, you'll be hammering it. But yeah, this is too towards the end of the season for uh, mountain biking over here in uh, Japan, or in Fujimi anyway. It'll be uh, winter soon. Next month, I reckon it starts getting very cold. It's quite cold now, but not too bad. Oh, this muddy stuff. Oh my God. No, thank you. Um, yeah, it gets real uh, cold and obviously it snows here. Where I am as well. It gets, um, should start snowing soon. It's like a crossing. So we're on a green trail now, number 14. We just swapped over from Twister. Yeah, it sounds like a waterfall just here. Yeah, that's cool. We got Tekken Z Trail. Oh, wow. That's cool. <laughs> oh, the forest here. Oh, my. It's unreal. Alrighty, let's um, keep going. Looks like um, the trail to my right just here is on um, that bridge run. I think that's a blue trail as well. Hopefully, get to ride that later. That looks pretty steep, though. <laughs> but um, pretty much got a whole day, I guess. So this was part one of two, and pretty much we just hit the greens and the blues and a little bit of black trail. In part two, I'll hit all the main black trails from the top to the bottom and some of the skills park, so subscribe for that. It'll be up next week.